Uh, hey, uh, I just found out about this, <clears throat> and um, I want to share this with you real quick. I'm hoping it's not true. You know, I've, I've put up a couple of posts, uploaded a couple of things about, about this uh, ding-dong here. But, uh, you know, people are people, and I'm really... Uh, I don't care what country I'm, you know, I, I just don't have any prejudice that way. There's a little bunch of them like this ding dong here that I can't stand. This moron is just, uh, he's just an idiot. But anyway, the thing here I wanted to share with you is 200 just found overnight, uh, dead in Korea. And it's all due to, this moron and his um i don't know his new toy of of nuclear disaster and um here it says um you can probably read it on here at least 200 dead as kim jong un nuclear base collapse north uh, collapses north korea has been hit by a disaster as Kim Jong-un's nuclear test site has suffered a collapse, killing 200. And I know that's kind of repetitive and bad reporting there, but, you know, it's this is a, a news channel um, that I just happened upon. This guy, is he's just something else. I, I don't know what your feelings are on him, but, you know, this is all coming out. And like I say, a few months back, I I uh, shared a video that showed where he had um, in a like a a, a musical type thing, a, 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 an orchestra, and everybody in the audience. Of course, they should have was in uniform, and uh, it was obviously doctored with thousands of people, uh, you know, in in the audience. But they were all cheering and 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 saying how great it was that uh, North Korea is going to send a nuclear bomb to at that time I think it was somewhere in California, San Francisco, wherever it was. And now this guy and he's prepping. You know he's not he wasn't even ready for it then. They're not ready for it now apparently. But um, in his preparation, um, a tunnel collapsed. And then in the, another tunnel collapse, you know, killing 100, and another collapsed, killing another 100 or so, and there's probably more than that, uh, in the, the people that was trying to rescue the first 100. So, you know, this, despite the warnings, uh, it says here, from uh, West, South Korea, and China, um, this guy continues to go on. It doesn't, you know, he doesn't seem to care. And people are nothing. They're just tools, damn. It's, you know, it's, it's like you pick up a, a hammer and you decide to smash a car with it and you break the handle. So just throw it away and go get another hammer. That's all this guy cares about. So I'm kind of concerned, one, two things. One, about these people. Uh, you know, it's really bad that he, they don't have a choice. They can't leave the country. Uh, you know, there's no, not everybody can get a passport like we can and, and so forth to get and go where you want. Uh, you can't say things, you can't do anything without being arrested by the uh, government for one reason or another. And, uh, you know, there's no freedom of religion, freedom of speech. Just what I'm saying right now could, if I was in China, could get me locked up in prison for the, for this. And uh, it's just, you know, the guy's a moron. And the second thing I'm concerned about is those who are um, protesting uh, President Trump or our government or whomever going and going against this guy, you know, saying that, you know, we whatever, we, he's just a person, you know, they deserve to do whatever they want to do and all that. That's just, I'm sorry, that's just about as moronic as you can get. I, I really hope nobody ever comes to me saying this guy is okay. He, he's just, 
ridiculous. So anyway, uh, not to you know bleed this on, but again, I, I don't believe this is this is uh, falsified. This appears to be news and um, going on here. So you know, keep in mind these people and not what they're going through. President Trump is going to be doing something here. He's going to address the nation about it because, uh, you know, just this collapse of a nuclear plant, you know, what it did to Japan and and all the things that happened, we're still wreaking, you know, havoc from that. And then who knows what this is going to cause is, you know, that could bleed over all all over the countries and who knows. So, uh, you know, look, you can, if you, you're able to, I'm not sure how yet, but, you know, look at some satellite imagery, what's going on here, and uh, just be aware of, of the needs of these people. Uh, you know, I'm not not saying, I'm not advocating going out and helping them, sending money, and that's a, you know, just if you if you have any kind of faith in, in pray for them, uh, you know, keep in mind anybody who wants to protest in uh, agreement of this moron. Think, think twice. Okay. This guy's a, he's a murderer. He's, uh, he's just looking, he's going to get people, he's going to get us, push us into war. And, you know, we don't need that. We don't need any more than what we've got. We don't need to be in what we got now. And I, I pray for our troops to get out of there as soon as possible. It's necessary. I know. And if I could, I'd be there, but, Keep in mind that these of these people of what's going on here, and don't uh, don't be drawn in to this idiot in what in his ways. Anyway, that's my say so on it. I I uh, I, uh, I hope you you can agree. Please uh, hit my like if you do. Uh, This is not anything special. I'm not trying to do anything other than just let you know what's going on. Thanks for watching. Uh, Please hit the like button and share and subscribe. Thanks. Bye.